It's time to give away free stuff! <laughs> what up? Your looter is your chance as a viewer to win one of our items from our vault, so to speak. And the way you do that is easy. You will submit your multiple choice questions, A, B, C, or D, uh, to the crate rate at gmail.com. And those questions can be about any item that we've unboxed. Nice. But specifically, they do not have to be about the item. Let's make it about the origin. You have The Walking Dead here. Let's ask some questions interesting about The Walking Dead. Anything that you th might think that will trip us up. If I can easily go back and watch one of my videos to find out the answer, that's probably not going to work it. I'm looking for something really, really challenging. The number two requirement is make sure you follow us on Twitter at the crit rate, so that way we can give you a shout out when you win. You have that perplexing look already. I was thinking about triple. Not stop with the triple. Okay. When you guys submit those questions, remember I will mail you one of those items. If you live outside the U.S., I'm not shipping out there. Um, but we will give you recognition on the show. Hales is going to read those questions. It'll be a face-off between Big Papa and myself to see who can answer correctly. No, unfortunately, he's winning. Unfortunately, he's winning right unfortunately, now. Unfortunately, Batman always wins. It's, you're not Batman. It's two to one. We have another viewer. Hales, first of all, introduce who it is and then read the question. This question is from Quentin Smith. Thank you for writing in, Quentin. The question is, in the February 2015 Loot Crate theme play, the dice you got, what were the intentional use for the dice? So what were the intentions of the included dice in the play-themed crate? Which is a very good question, Quentin, because as you guys know, we did not film... We did not. The unboxing or the reveal for play. That was between season one and two. Yes, it was. So, Hales, what are our options for choices? A, rock, paper, scissors. B, high fives and fist bumps. C, to throw at your friends. D, for the board game on the box it was made out of. I'm going to put this in. You stop cheating. I'm going to put this answer down. I'm going to write it really, really small. And I'm going to fold it a lots of times. I don't know. I don't know. I'll but, read them one more time. A. Rock, paper, scissors. B. High fives and fist bumps. C. To throw at your friends. Or D. For the board game the box was made out of. So, yeah. I think I have a pretty strong idea. I don't. You being a Wolverines fan means you're probably wrong, but let's find out. I'm Hales, always here's right. my answer. I'm Batman. You're not Batman. Keep stop stealing my thunder. Uh, Told you I was gonna write it small. We have one winner here. One winner. It's me. It can't be you. Batman is it always winning. Can't be me. It can't be you. Batman always wins. And do you guys want to know who won? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. yes. He did. Whoa! Now it's all tied. It is now two to two. Quentin, great question. What did you choose? What was the answer? The answer was D. I wrote D. Look. you. I wrote D. That looks like an A to me. What? What's that? You scratched it out. No! Oh! You scratched it out. I should have stayed with it. You should always go with your first instinct. Quentin, thank you for your question. Make sure you guys submit yours. The email address one more time is thecraterate at gmail.com. Follow us on Twitter at the crate rate. Big Papa is at US Beer Traders. Hails, as always, is Hailstorm3107. And until our unboxing, guys, keep crate rating.